Hey, what's up guys? It's Black Fox here and finally getting around to posting some new videos. Actually, this is recorded back when Black Ops was still popular and brand new, but I figured I'd start posting some of these videos considering the new consoles are coming out. Um, I'm still kind of debating if I want to get the PS4 or the Xbox. I'll probably end up getting the uh, Xbox because that's what all my buddies play on and they're all playing Titanfall. Yeah, I know I'm kind of kind of late to the party on Titanfall, but better late than never, right? I'm sure uh, a ton of people probably aren't on it yet because, you know, obviously the new console is pretty expensive. Um, I figure I'll just buy the uh, Titanfall bundle pack, you know, just get, get the good deal with that. Um, so yeah, that's what I'll probably end up doing some new videos for. I got a bunch of uh, Battlefield ones, but like I said, I'm going going back and posting all these old videos that I have, feeling up space on my computer. Uh, you know, I, I'm not that big of a fan of Black Ops, uh, Black Ops 1. Uh, I didn't think it was that great, but then again, any game you play with your buddies, as long as you're having fun, is a good game, right? And back when this first came out, you know, it was the new game and had fun playing with my buddies. You know, going back and watching some of these videos, obviously, like I said, I don't think it's as good as the other Call of Duties. I'm sure a lot of people will probably hate me for it because they love Black Ops. I actually never played the uh, Black Ops 2. Uh, I got Battlefield, and Battlefield's pretty much what I play now. But uh, when the new consoles come out, I'll have to see what's good for those. Uh, if you guys got any suggestions for any good online or offline uh, games, uh, some of the games I looked at that looked pretty good were obviously uh, Destiny, Titanfall, uh, the new Metal Gear, uh, Dead Rising 3, uh, also a game that's coming out that looks really good, it uh, kind of looks similar to like some of the Silent Hills and stuff, is the, um, uh, what is it called, oh, the uh, Evil Within or whatever, it looks like a pretty uh, sci-fi, or uh, pretty crazy mind bender type thing like the Silent Hill games and I've always been a fan of creepy games if a game can give me good skill uh, scare I definitely uh, definitely like it so if you guys got any good recommendations or if you guys have any preferences opinions if PlayStation or Xbox is better you know I'd love to hear them so leave them down in the comments below uh, always open to hear what people say. I mean, it's pretty. I'm pretty determined that I'll end up getting the Xbox One, even though I think the Xbox One is kind of a dumb name for it. I think it should, you know, should have been the Xbox 720 or whatever. But I mean, I understand where they're coming with the whole Xbox One, one console for the whole media center. I mean, I'm definitely happy that plays the uh, Blu-rays now. Uh, that's primarily one of the reasons why I got the PlayStation 3. Um, I only ended up getting like eight games for my PlayStation. I was always a fan of the PlayStation because of games like Metal Gear Solid and God of War, but now even Metal Gear has gone over to Xbox One, which I guess it makes sense, you know what I mean? Um, it, uh, console exclusives is kind of a, kind of a dying thing now, especially because the consoles have so much more power these days, whereas back in the day, you know, it was more specifics between the two but uh most likely i'll end up getting both because that's kind of been my track record of having both consoles and plus the good thing about having both consoles is you're really not limited to anything but online i i realized over the last consoles is i have always played xbox online i played rainbow six on the original xbox uh uh and then you know i played halo xbox played gears of war xbox Played Call of Duty's Xbox, uh, played Battlefield Xbox. The only game I ever played online on PlayStation was Killzone, and uh, I, I wasn't too much of a fan of that. I mean, the campaigns were good and everything like that, but uh, I, I played all the way through campaign of Killzone 1 and partially through 2, and uh, actually never did even get 3, so... Like, I'm, I'm all support for PlayStation because I, I, I love their policies and everything like that. Obviously, Xbox wanted to require all games for online connectivity just for campaign, just like Diablo, which I hate that feature. I mean, I understand why, but I just, I, I really think that's really putting, putting a strain on the game or really limiting them because I uh, have a couple friends that they don't even hook their Xboxes up to the internet. 
because they don't play online games, they just play games for campaign. And if all games require online connectivity, it's, you know, you figure it's going to hurt people in the long run, so. So that's my video and kind of my rant for that one. Good job, team. We executed the mission perfectly.